This is a nice place. Yeah, I found it on one of those internet B&Bs. Don't you have to use a card to pay for those? Yeah. What do you think, I used one of my cards? Y'all set up? Yeah. Clear line of sight. Plenty of elevation. All we need is a target. Here you go. Is that the uh, rifle you used on that Arab prince? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she and I have uh, seen a lot of good times together. I can't believe you got away with that one. Oh, it's like the land of a thousand princes, man. I doubt anybody even noticed. Who's our target today? Heather Greenwood. All right. We've got a whole dossier here, and all you look at is the picture. What? What more do I need? I don't know. Like, who does she work for? Why do they want her dead? What do you care? You're going to put a bullet in her. Well, that's why I care. Somebody wants me to kill somebody. I want to know what. Not our job to judge. Just do. I think you should look at this one. I got what I need. All right. We should get set up. Heather will be a buy in a, a bit. Let's get this table moved out of the way. Hey. What was your best day on the job? Best day? Oh, man. This one time I was in this cafe in Paris. A city of love. Not this time. <laughs> so there I was, enjoying my espresso, and suddenly there are these three rusky goons on me, and all I had was a tiny little spoon. Stabbed the fuck right out of them. <laughs> What about you? Oh, I, my best day was actually in a cafe as well. Yeah, I was reading a book. <laughs> That's very hipster of you. <laughs> I was in Kabul at the time. Better. Anyway, sitting there reading my book and out of nowhere, man, this Hajibi badass decides he wants to take a run at me with this huge knife. I mean, <laughs> it's practically a sword. Thankfully, my reading material happened to be quite appropriate for the moment. Oh, sweet. Okay. What was your worst day? I mean, what kind of shit have you seen? 
Oh, God. You're gonna dredge up some dark stuff. I mean, come on, it's just us here. I mean, if you can't tell this shit to me, then who can you tell it to? This one time I was in Kosovo. I had been in this shit a long time. I had found a 18 year bottle of scotch hidden out in a bombed out building. I had run out of bullets for my 1911, but I had a grenade. I was a quarter of the way through that bottle when someone found me. I can't even remember which side it was. Didn't matter. I had to use my grenade. I can't look at a finger of scotch the same way anymore. <laughs> You're such a fuck. You know that? I'm trying to have a serious moment here, man. Talking about the life. You're cracking fucking jokes. All right, tough guy. You want to share all of your feelings? What was your worst day? Well, you know, since you asked, I'll tell you. And I'm going to be completely honest here. I... She's here. Where? 10 o'clock. Got it. Range me. 320... No, 325 meters. Negative 30 degrees. Crosswind from the left. 10 knots. Got it. This is too easy. All right, call the shot. Off the train station, the water tower, ricochet off the numbers. Nothing but heart. You got it. Sorry. You should have read that dossier. My worst day. <laughs> 